Everybody is talking about China's new virus, mycoplasma pneumonia or walking pneumonia. This disease is not limited to China only, it is spreading all over the world. Since this virus is contagious, you should know more information about this virus. It is so harsh on your child, so you must know the information which I am going to talk about. In this video, I am going to talk about what is walking pneumonia or mycoplasma pneumonia, what are the symptoms, what are the treatments available to control this disease, how you can prevent your child from walking pneumonia. Uh, so don't skip this video, keep on watching, let's jump into the video. First of all, we need to understand the type of disease. This bacteria is very unique because it doesn't have cell walls. If bacteria has cell walls, then antibiotics really works fast because it usually breaks down the cell walls of the bacteria you can get relief soon but this time it is so harsh because this bacteria doesn't have any kind of cell walls so certain type of antibiotics are not working to fight with this bacteria mycoplasma bacteria causes infection it is directly related to your lungs since your child and your toddler lungs are still developing if your kid is below 5 then their immune system is still in developing phase that's why this pneumonia is spreading very fast in children as I said that this bacteria causes lung infection, symptoms appear as a mild cold and cough or like a flu symptoms and your child or you don't need to require hospitalization. Since China's population is surging, that's why this disease has become so serious. Since this disease is contagious, your child can get it from daycare or from school or from anywhere in the group. And winter surge diseases are very common, so mycoplasma infection is very common. If I talk about the symptoms in detail, uh, first of all, it starts with cold and cough, and you wouldn't feel that you have a pneumonia, and later on, uh, it would be followed by fatigue, high fever or mild fever, and then you have sore throat also. And then you get to know that you have walking pneumonia. Usually, walking pneumonia is milder than pneumonia, uh, and it has mild symptoms only. It really depends upon your child's immune system that how well they can fight with the disease. So so your child's immune system should be strong enough to fight with this disease. What causes mycoplasma infections? If you have cold and cough and when you sneeze, the droplets spread through the air and it is contagious so anyone can get it. It can be confirmed by blood test or swab collection test. How mycoplasma pneumonia is treated? Uh, as I said that most of the antibiotics don't work on that disease so your healthcare provider prescribe you according to your symptoms. If you have very mild symptoms you can take over the counter medicines and you can also try few home remedies on which I am going to talk about separately in my next video. Besides that there are few types of antibiotics which work on this bacteria. Once you start taking antibiotic uh, you will feel better in two to four days uh, since your child has lung infection it could take one month to get relief. If I talk about prevention, this is really difficult to stop your child from playing or from going to school. You can practice good hygiene and you can teach your child to cover uh, nose and mouth when they sneeze and when they cough. So at least we can control to spread it. If you are sick, then staying home is the best remedy to control this disease. So I would suggest you at this time, please avoid cold drinks because it can give you sore throat and uh, you can drink green tea or hot water uh, frequently. So even if you have any kind of infection, it wouldn't be that much severe. Uh, if you think that this information has added value in your life, then please take a moment and click on subscribe button. I will talk about few home remedies that is really beneficial uh, to control uh, flu, sore throat and cold. Your child can use those remedies as well. Uh, I will see you in my next video. Till then, bye-bye.